Let's go and welcome everybody to Doki Doki Literature Club Rewind. I just finished the mod Doki Doki Literature Club Summertime, so I was on the lookout for a new mod that was a little bit shorter, a little bit different, a little bit special, a little bit unique. I was looking through some people's favorites lists, doing some perusing, and uh, Rewind seemed to appear in a lot of people's favorites. So I figured, why not give it a go? It matched all the criteria, and let's see what happens. The only thing I know about this mod is that it's something similar to like, uh, you know, Groundhog's Day, like reliving the same day over and over again. And, you know, your choices matter. So, you know, depending on what you pick, you might go down the reality that'll break out of the endless time loop that we're in or something like that. There's possibly some horror. There's possibly some romance. There's possibly a lot of things that are entailed in this mod but I'm not quite sure what it is. So, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's get into the mod. And actually, I have one more quick thing to say. The mod is still a demo. So I don't know if it's really complete or if maybe we're going to stop like halfway through. I'm not sure. Uh, but yeah, without further ado, let's get into the mod. And if we love it, we will definitely wait for the full release. So, yeah, let's get into it, boys and girls. Ah, uh, yeah, player of Doki Doki Literature Club, we know, we agree. Come on, boys and girls. What, what do you think? We're not a veteran to this scene at this point. In, in fact, you know what? I think I have some authority in this community nowadays. Do you know how many mods I've played at this point? Like 19, bruv. Quite a lot. Ooh, I like that cassette tape. That looks very nice. Um, so, you know, I, I, I got my bearings nowadays. You know what I'm saying? New game, of course. It's your freaking boy, Rar. And let's get into it. Crack open a cold one for the boys. Sit back, relax. Oh, gosh. A little indigestion. Get comfy. You know what it is. Comment down below. Who is this? Who is this? Siori? Too easy of a guess. It's freaking Natsuki, bro. Just, it's totally Siori. Come on. Who are we kidding? Hey... I see an annoying girl running towards me from the distance, waving her arms in the air. It's Yori, my neighborhood friend. If, listen, if you assumed we played the base game, why the freaking heck are we reading this text right now, my dude? I've been walking to school forever, yada yada. She's chasing me. I almost feel like I should run away. Fuck that hoe. Oh, oh did you hear that sound effect? Little, she's a speed demon. It's like when you, uh... You know, if you were like a kid or, I mean, really whatever age, but I feel like I remember getting like sticks and like swinging them around really quickly. And that, you know, to hear like the sound, uh, like like the stick cutting through the, the sound barrier and making like the whoo sound, you know what I'm talking about? That's Yori, too speedy. Uh, uh, I overslept again, but I caught you this time. Uh, maybe, but only because I decided to stop and wait for you. Eh, you say that like you were thinking about ignoring me. That's mean, Rar. Well, if people stare at you, uh, people, okay, yeah. <clears throat> okay, they stare at us, they think we're weirdos, it's your fault, Siori, we know. Fine, fine, you waited for me, I love you, Rar. Like, Rar, I seriously fucking love you, I wanna, I wanna marry you, Rar. Just please, take my hand in marriage. Aw, oh, do you see her little determined face? That's so cute. <laughs> we cross the street and make our way to school. As we draw near, the streets become increasingly speckled with students. Roar, have you decided a club to join? No, fuck the literature club. I don't like reading books. I just want to sit in my house forever. The going home club, have you heard of it, Siori? Probably not, because you don't love anime as much as I do. And 2D women. You see, Siori, you can't find 2D women out and about in the environment. You know where you find them? At your goddamn PC with the 1080 Ti graphics card, the i9 processor, so we can get all those pixelated, beautiful, bodacious anime girls in our faces in almost real time. <clears throat> uh, Rar, what are you talking about? You're such a weirdo. Your happiness is important to me, you know? And I know you're happy, but you shouldn't be in neat forever. Trust me. Don't make me keep worrying. Okay, alright, okay, alright. I'll look at a few clumps. 
No promises. Will you promise me you'll try a little? Yeah, 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 yay! Why do I let myself get lectured by such a dope-headed girl? More than that, I'm surprised that I, I don't know what she said. Siori, just shut up, okay? We're going to school. We'll go to the literature club. If it has cute girls, we'll sign up, okay? It's that easy. It's really just that easy. If they can rival the 2D waifus in my visual novel, Siori, I would join the literature club. That's the stipulation we have here for today. The school day is ordin uh, very ordinary. I stare blankly at the wall. Clubs. She wants me to check out clubs. Maybe I should go to the anime club. Hey, Siori, you want to uh, um, go to the anime club? I, I don't know, okay? Uh, Siori, hello. I was spacing out. I was thinking about uh, um, 2D anime. I was thinking about uh, genetically engineered cat girls and when that's coming in the future. Uh, yup. Uh, yeah, I really want to... Um, I want to turn my cat into a cat girl so I can love her unconditionally. Not that he can't already do that with a regular cat, but come on, cat girls are better, bro. Mm. I had this conversation on stream before. Do you think it would be impossible if we do genetically engineer cat girls? Do you think it would be Do you think it would be possible to impregnate cat girls? Let me know down in the comments below. You're terrible, Roar. Stop it. Uh, that makes me feel great. <laughs> I'm a masochist, Siori, by the way. I don't think you understand that. You're too much of a lighthearted girl. That's why I'm more attracted to Natsuki, the one that will beat the fuck out of me. Uh, what are you doing here? Siori looks like she was waiting to take me to the club. Yeah, cool. All right, fine. We'll go to the literature club. Whatever. It doesn't really matter, Siori. It, I'll, I'll tell you that I'll give it a try, but I'm, I'm just going to say no regardless. Again, unless there's cute girls, Siori. Um, <clears throat> uh, yes. <laughs> uh, how many club members are there? Why does that matter? Well, I want to know if they're girls, Siori. Come on. Siori. At two... What? How? Isn't there like some sort of minimum minimum size you need for a club? Yeah, it's three. So like, I really need you, Rar. <laughs> but once we get a third member, we can finish the uh, founding paperwork. Founding paperwork. Siori, does this club even fucking exist? No, it's a figment of my imagination. Maybe. <laughs> Siori, did you? Did you join a club that isn't actually a club? She fidgets for a second. I don't think she expected me to actually ask any questions. Somehow. Look, I'm friends with the girl that started the club. I want it to be a great club, okay? Join Rar. Girl. <laughs> now you're speaking my language. Uh, plus, I promised to get somebody to sign up, so like, you basically have to Rar, or like, I'll never be a friend again. Siori, no! I assume you guys don't really mind that I'm, like, skipping through this text, right? We all know that, like, this is original DDLC base mod stuff. Uh, I'm assuming you're liking my narration more than me actually reading this jank garbage that we've read a thousand times already. I'm not hating the mod, by the way. I, it's totally fine if they want to do this introductory stuff. If I make a mod, I will definitely never do this. But, you know, man, it's personal preference. I get it. It's fine. I just feel like the reason why you would do stuff like this would be, um, like, build up for storytelling so, like, you care about the characters more and stuff like that, but, like, we already have that, you know what I mean? Because we've played a million mods already. <laughs> this is, like, to get, like, a base understanding of the characters already, but we know that. Anyway, I don't know. Um, don't expect me to stick around. Um, it better be a really good club with lots of cute girls or I will not join Siori. We already know this. Uh, who's the friend? Monica. Oh my god, you mean the hottest girl in school? Okay, okay, I'm starting to get a little interested, except I'm a beta, uh, submissive man, so I don't think I can assert dominance over Monica. She's kind of way out of my league. <laughs> uh, looks like a light has gone off in her head. Um, is it because she's just so much more popular than you? That's literally, yes, that's exactly what I'm saying, Siori, is that I cannot compare. You hit the nail on the head. And I'm talking about, like, like a hammer where it doesn't even have one of those, like, backwards parts where you can pull the nail out. Like, we're, we're done. You hit it. 
you're good. There's no backing out now. Are there hammers that exist without the part that you pull out? Probably not. Yeah, there are, like those rubber hammers. You know, like the big rubber, the rubber boys. Or even like, um, uh, uh, oh my God, what is her name? Um, <clears throat> Harley Quinn. She has a one without a, a pull out as well. No, no pull out game for Harley Quinn. <laughs> I feel like I'm talking at like a, a million words a second here. I feel like I'm approaching this how I usually like do my Twitch live streams almost where I'm just like endlessly rambling about insane shit constantly. So if you're liking this so far and you, 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 you haven't checked out my Twitch channel, you'd probably very much enjoy it. Twitch link will be down in the description below. Just, just saying, you can go follow my channel. Just saying, I live stream like literally every day for hours on end, bro. Anyway. Um, she's just busy, uh, she was head of the debate club, I, she left it to join the literature club with you, Siori. You are BFFs. Actually, who's supposed to be Siori's best friend in, um, in Doki Doki Literature Club? Because it's pretty much canon that, like, Yori and Natsuki are, like, supposed to be the closest, right? I still never really fully understood that. Maybe that's not supposed to be canon, but a lot of mods make it seem that way. Probably just because everybody wants to ship the girls and make them have sex. If I had to guess. <laughs> this video is like definitely never gonna be monetized. I, how, how, does, does YouTube, I've heard that YouTube only listens to what I have to say for the first one minute and then they don't care what the hell is said after that. I don't know if that's true though. I haven't been able to experiment yet, you know, Monetiza monetization, that's not really a thing I got. Um, we should go find Monica. Yay! I follow Siori. Um, she's leaning up against a pillar doing paperwork. She's extremely focused. Watch ha! Monica, guess who I found? Okay, I think I can probably actually read the text uh, good now because this is kind of like uh, new stuff. Kind of. So, here we go. Oh, that was fast. You were only gone, uh, what, 10 minutes? I know, I told you I could get someone here before you finished. <laughs> I guess you were right after all, Siori. Uh, so did Siori have you twist your... <clears throat> uh, um, <y> yes. <laughs> Monica trails off as she takes a second to look over me. She's probably trying to remember my name or something. I bet she doesn't remember it at all. I'm stuttering, man. Oh, Rar! It's been a while. I didn't know that Siori was talking about you. It's good to see you again. Okay, that caught me off guard. Uh, yeah, you too. Uh, handshake? H handshake, Monica? Nice, nice to meet you again? Oh, I'm never washing this hand again. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Why do I do this? <laughs> That's the best I can come up with quickly. I wasn't expecting her to even have a slight memory of me, much less remember who I am. Rar has already agreed to join. We can start the club already. Oh, that's very interesting, actually. So Yori and, and Natsuki do not exist right now. I know that Siori, yes, said that she only has two members. I assume that she meant, um... Uh, Yori and Natsuki were the two members and that she wasn't counting herself and Monica. I don't think that's the case though. Hmm. Actually, yeah, of course that's the case because she's saying if she got us, then it'd be four members which can start a club. So it's like, um, wait, what? No, that'd mean there's only three. <laughs> I literally thought of myself as someone and the MC as another person. Holy shit. Um... So who the hell is the other person? We're missing someone, yes, no, we'll see. No reason to speculate. Um, wow, that's kind of impressive, really. I guess you were a good pick for vice president. Vice president? Well, I guess she's the first friend Monica thought to ask, that makes sense. Uh, so uh, anyway, uh, what else do you have to do to uh, start the club? She always said something about helping with paperwork? Oh God, I feel like I need a burp. I can't, I can't, I can't burp while I'm doing Monica's, Monica's voice. I can't taint her like that. All right, we're good. 
Oh, we just have to fill these out. Once I sign these last three, the club officially exists. Monica takes a second, staring at the pile of papers on her clipboard. Clipboard. Okay, give me a minute to split this and we'll all start filing the paperwork out together. That way, we can still have some time left over for today. Instead of waiting for me to finish. <laughs> Monica starts to hand out the papers to both of us, clearly trying to keep certain things packed together. After a minute of this, we all, uh, we've all got enough that it's not overwhelming, but we'll definitely be here for a bit. As soon as Yuri starts actually filling out the papers, she looks at them as though if they're written in some foreign language she doesn't understand. After a few seconds, she looks over at me and carefully places a, her bag down at the benches. She then plops right down next to the bag. I guess she wants to try to focus on her packet better. Monica, though, seems like she's busily tearing through the forms. After another minute, Monica notices. Uh, Monica takes notice of Siori and gently eases her down on the opposite side of the bench. Monica lets out a small sigh of relief as she does this. I guess she was tired of standing. Sori looks over at Monica for a second and looks up at me. Hey, you should sit down with us. <laughs> right in the middle, bro? Bro, <laughs> champ, let's go. Uh, you'll get tired standing like that. Oh yeah, that's why I sat too. Go ahead and sit with us if you like. Oh, bro! We got a choice already! Okay, um, man, I'm not used to this. The last episode I recorded, um, on YouTube, I, I, I literally did it for an hour and a half straight, because it was the finale of Doki Doki Summertime, and I premiered that. By the way, you should definitely check it out. It was a great video. Um, so I I'm used to, like, just endlessly going for hours and hours on end at this point. But, um, I, I, I think this makes sense for, for a good place to stop. We kind of, um, this, this is almost... Kind of like the end cap of the prologue. You know, this is this is where stuff is really gonna start happening. Also, I just realized why it, I, you know what, I, I know what I'm gonna do. Hold, hold, hold on a second here, kids. Actually, here, let me save real quick. There's only one save slot. Interesting. Um, <clears throat> One second here, watch this. What? Oh God, I grabbed the wrong thing. Why is a window here? You make no sense. There's one here too. What is this? What? It, what is the point of you? What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Um. Well, I guess we'll just end down here. Man, I feel like a small short boy now. Um. Yes, this is where we're gonna stop because we are at our first choice, and it's gonna be a good one, baby. Um, this mod seems cool. Again, the fact- I, I love mods that are just very heavily choice-based, and this definitely seems like one. I feel like almost this is gonna be like, um, kind of like the Yuri Parable, but, um, not just the Stanley Parable, like, just a game with a lot of choices and different realities and, and replaying the same day over and over again. I mean, it sounds really cool. So, we, we will really dissect this and figure out, um... What will be the correct option here, kids? But yeah, with that being said, uh, like the video if you enjoyed. Uh, subscribe, comment. You know, don't forget to uh, answer my comment question of the day. What was that? Uh, what underwear color are you wearing? I forget what it was. Um, anyway, thank you for watching, everybody. Um, much love, take care, and have a damn good one.